Good morrow to you. Yes, tis I, Dr. Beauregard Lahanty, lever of voicemails to the stars. Call me back, Dame Maggie. And assistant head of dramatic arts at the prestigious Colavoce Academy. Suivre la voix. As you may well know, Colavoce Theatre is turning five. We sank a joyeux anniversaire. And what better way to celebrate than a bit of role play? Now, put down your whip and baby onesie. I'm talking adventure. To celebrate this momentous occasion, I have bequeathed to you the famed La Hunty Fortune. Never mind what it is. In order to find it, you will have to traverse my theatre quest. Yes, I have devised an entirely new gaming modality that can be played simply upon a tabletop. I call it a tabletop role-playing interactive game. Patent pending. Yes, you heard me. Interactive. <laughs> what do you mean, how? Well, <laughs> fire up your personal computer and let me show you. Et voilà! <laughs> Juste comme ça, tis still I, Dr. Beauregard La Hunty, but coming to you via the magic of technology! <laughs> roger, roger, over, over, going dark! <laughs> and no, this is not simply a still image I am projecting to you. I promised you interactive, and I am giving you interactive! <laughs> And what's this we spy? Some sort of bus. May we board it? Um, yes we may. Interactive! What's that driver? The next stop is fun. Well, <laughs> allow me to alight. And lo, we suddenly find ourselves in yet another magical virtual realm for us to explore. <laughs> now thanks to this technological wizardry... Oh, cactus. Cactus! Must there be so many cacti? Oh. And thanks to this technological wizardry, not only are you able to play from the comfort of your own chaise long, but also band together with fellow adventurers from across the globe. Ha <laughs> ha! Bubbles be damned. <gasps> What's this I spy? <gasps> Why, tis all our Colavoce friends busy preparing for the festivities. Oh, humble innkeeper, how go the preparation? Come through. Right, can we get that door fixed, please? Props? Where are I? It's six days away. Thank you. How do I? Oh. Right, everyone. I'm not... Keith, can you come out from behind that lamp, please? Six days! Oh, Ian and Euphemia, I know it's interesting to talk about robotic headwear, but please focus on your rehearsals. Oh, Harry, Harry, please tell me it's all going well. Ah, you found it all then. That's great stuff. Oh, fuck. Can someone get lighting design on the phone? The blackout in the fifth act doesn't happen until after Harry has finished his line. Shepard, will you let go of Lamb? He has lines to rehearse. Oh, Alexandra, my darling, please, please tell me you're ready. You just look really different from your preacher. Preacher. Can I have everyone's attention, please? If I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times. Enunciate. Oh, my wisest mage, thank goodness for you. You in there, please. I don't care where your cat is. I need you to focus on the task at hand. Robert. Face the audience. Fran, oh Fran, please tell me you have finally memorised your Act 4 monologue. Fran, oh, oh. <laughs> Put down that bottle and pick up a script. Tammy and Tilda, don't leave this lying around, please. Jasmine, Jasmine, where are you, Jasmine? Jasmine, there are too many cacti outside, and lighting, and props, and no one knows their lines. People, please, if I can do it, you can do it. Without warning, you are transported to a seemingly... No. Without warning, you find yourself in the middle of a stranded... No. I'll get there. I'll get there. There's still six days. There's still six days. I've nothing to prove, least of all to you. So, see you on the 6th of Feb! Jasmine! Jasmine!